All right, guys, interesting one today. Can magic mushrooms potentially help treat depression? I want to look at that. Now, as you're probably aware, magic mushrooms uh, aren't legal. They're a schedule one. Uh, so in most states, they're not legal. But a couple of states, namely at the time I'm making this video, Colorado and Oregon, allow magic mushrooms to be used under controlled or medical supervision. And so in this video, I'm going to look at what the studies actually show uh, dosing and also safety of potentially doing this. So first of all, magic mushrooms, the, the active ingredient is psilocybin. Now psilocybin, uh, is immediate, almost immediately converted to psilocybin. Okay. Now what goes on when you take this? Well, what the studies are showing has been pretty promising. Okay. So in studies, they're giving a 25 milligram dose of psilocybin or magic mushrooms. Uh, and they're doing it as a single dose. Now, what they've seen is that when you combine magic mushrooms with psychotherapy, um, they're seeing improvements in depression, uh, seeing improvements in chances of remission. So the depression going away for up to 12 months, and that's with the single dose. So for a lot of people, this is definitely a viable option if they can get access, uh, you know, to that therapy under control circumstances. Now, what about safety? Obviously, uh, you know, everybody knows shrooms, magic mushrooms can have sort of some downsides, um, when a lot of people are using it recreationally, but we do know in the studies that there can be some side effects. They tend not to be super serious and tend to be short term. Uh, first one would be headache. Again, that is a short term thing. Uh, some people can see increases in blood pressure and heart rate. Um, but again, with controlled and under medical supervision, side effects are pretty minimal. Now, the last thing I want to talk about a lot of people, um, you know, they can source magic mushrooms and they can start doing this microdosing thing. Microdosing has not shown benefit for depression as of the time I'm making this video. Um, also there's some safety concerns with it, primarily the products that people are trying to source this from to do this. So the bottom line is guys, magic mushrooms, can they help with depression? Yes, it appears. So, uh, you have to do it the right way. You have to do it under medical supervision. Um, and fairly low incidence of side effects seems to be pretty safe. So it's a good option for some people and they may want to look into that. Um, let me know in the comments, other video topics you'd like me to cover. This was a prime example. Also grab your free checklist, guys. The link is in the description. I'll see you in the next one.